So, this is going to be a great video. I hope you guys are ready for this. We're going to talk about the difference between being a good man and a nice guy. And I'm going to make this make sense for those of you that don't know the difference. So basically, you know, nice people to me are very manipulative. Some of these people might not be the worst human beings on earth, but some of them are. And a lot of the time, when you're around people, bro, that's just being too damn nice, too overly nice. A lot of the time, a very, very, very high percentage of the time, these people ain't it. They're not what you think. And what does a lot of people teach us growing up? Just be nice, be nice. When you go here, be nice, be polite. It's an act. It's not even genuine. There's a huge difference. You know, niceness is an act. You can be a good person without coming off as this nice person. Hi. It's just, in the way people go on and on and on and on and on and just act so nice. To me, it's manipulative. You can be a good person without being that way. A good person is a complete control. A good person has respect. It's respect. But these nicey nice people, bro, they want to be that nice to you and, and act this way around you so you open up and loosen up to them. So you can be right nice back and treat them kindly. Treat me kind. Don't be a good person. Just treat me kind. It's stupid. It's stupid. And it took me a couple seconds in life to really understand what this is about. You know, I've seen so many people in so many different places, in school, outside of school, just wherever, like growing up. I've seen their nice act. And I started to see through it. So I started to despise these really overly nice people. Because I knew what they were doing. And, you know... These same people, bro, they want you to loosen up. When you're being a serious person. Of respect and good morals. They want that kind of person to loosen up. Why? Because you're being real. You're just good. You're a good human being. You don't have to be so nice to be a good human being. But this is an act that these people put on. And if you're a nice guy watching this video, you have to stop being this guy to your family. If you have children, to, your, to the girls you talk to? Are you kidding me, bro? <laughs> Do you think I talk to these girls? Just like this nice guy? Yeah, I'm such a good guy. I don't give a solitary fuck. And they know this. I just don't care. Like, that's just the guy I am. And it might sound bad to some of you, but I swear to God, bro, it's not bad and it's it's good. Like I'm I'm just a fair game guy. It's not that I despise you, it's not that I love you. It's just I have a life, you know, that I like. So I just could care less if I'm talking to you, if I'm not talking to you. I got shit to do. I'm good, you know, I'm just if you're a really great person, I mean, then maybe someday, if you're a good friend, maybe someday, if you could have a friendship, something could, have, something could come about. But it's like, that's just the vibe I have as a human being, bro. Uh, 
I just don't care. People care too much. People... I don't know. People that overly care, bro, it's like... You have to care, but it's like not overly care. I, it, it's so hard to teach people how to be, and you really can't. But at the end of the day, bro, it's... You're going to be what you're going to be, but things can help, I mean understand certain things i'm trying to make this make sense to the best of my ability bro that's what i do best i'm really trying to make this make sense to the best of my ability i don't want to miss a beat that's kind of what i do i'm really thinking this through but there's a huge difference like i said from being mr or mrs nicey nice to just being a good person you're a good person you're not so nicey nice, you're just a good person. Hi. How are you? Good. That's good. And not so robotic like, but like you understand what I'm saying. Like you're a person that has it together. You're a person that has has his or her head on their shoulders. You're a good person, you're doing no wrong. You don't gotta be overly nice to draw lure people in. A lot of girls do that shit, bro, and they over compliment. They do weird things, and this is what these nice guys do as well. They're so caught up over complimenting and stuff like this, and they're all in the frenzy and trying to make her feel a certain way. You just have to talk, bro. You, you just be yourself. You think you need to do all these things, all this extra, do something crazy for her. Take her on these extravagant dates and, and do all this crazy shit and be so nice to her and all this stuff. It's a bunch of bullshit. It's not, it's not it, bro. Like, that's not it. <sighs> if you're just a good lad, the amount of success, the amount of things that will come your way will be unimaginable. People want to be a part of it. People want to be a part of your life. And not everybody will be able to be a part of your life, but everyone's gonna to want to be a part of your life because you're that damn solid. And that's what it is. But, you know, people know you're a fair game person. People know you're not a crazy monster. People know you're not this nice guy. People know you're just a fair game good dude. And that's the difference. So many guys take the route of being this nice guy to these girls, to whatever. You're overly nice when you go certain places and see people and all this stuff. And it's like, I just stay stoked, bro. I stay... I'm here for business. It's just a business mindset. It's a, it's a successful mindset with, with everything, bro. How you do one thing is how you do everything. And there's no point in being overly nice. It's stupid. I remember, bro, being like, and you know, we've, we've all been there before. We've all been in these positions where we had to be overly nice at times to somebody in a, in a certain situation. I remember whenever I was a younger teenager, bro, and I would go certain places. You open the door, someone's mom is waiting at the door or close to it, greeting you in. She's all nice and stuff, and you gotta be that nice back, and it's, and you start to go there enough, and it starts to just not be that way, and you kind of start to see her for what she is and I don't know bro that shit just it's just an act it's not real but people want to come off that way people want to come off as I want to I want this person to view me as I'm so nice I want this person to think that I'm such a nice person and stuff so is it really who you are no This is why I'm saying, bro, like, when people come around me, I'm no different than if you were not even here. I'm just me. Hi. 
If I open the door right now and you see me and I see some new person, I'm still me. I'm not, oh, hi, hi, hi. No, I'm still me, bitch. Bitch what? It doesn't mean you can ever laugh. It doesn't mean you can ever express yourself. But it's like to be that nicey nice person. You guys know what I'm talking about, bro. It's stupid. It really is. And it's not who the person is. It's not who you are. Every time I had to be this way, at, 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 at like in, in certain places that I had to go to, especially when I was younger, because I'm not even this way no more at all. Like, I don't care where I go, bro. I could go to some, let's say, you meet this new girl, you go to her house or whatever, meet the parents the first time. I'm not even going to be that way, bro. Like, I'm going to come off a bit nicer, obviously, but not such this, you know, they're going to get an idea and an understanding of who I am pretty quick. Of course, you'll be polite, of course, those things, but you guys get it, bro. Just don't be that nicey, nice person to try to do things in that way because it's really not who you are. I hate that shit, bro. I'm not going to lie. I hate that shit. I even despise going to certain places today and having to dumb myself down a little bit because I just like to be calm, cool cold stoic just emotionless just yeah i'm here congratulations i'm here and i'm here to buy this so i'm gonna buy this and i'm gonna leave thank you i'm out i feel good i, I don't have to invest too much emotion i'm gonna invest too much of anything uh i have a business mindset bro it's not like oh my god he's such a bad person I got shit to do all the time. Once I get done what I need to get done here, I'm off to the next, I'm off to the next, I'm off to the next. So there's no time to be that way for me. It's just a waste of energy. It's stupid. I feel dumb when I have to do those things. I feel slow. I can't be who I am. My mind is just too fast for the world, bro. I genuinely feel that way. When I go into like places in, in the worldly world, you go to the supermarkets, you go to the stores, you gotta deal with people, you gotta talk to people. There's the odd there's the odd people that's actually pretty damn fast too. But when it comes to most people, they they pretty damn slow in the head, bruh. When you gotta deal with these hairdressers, bro, they'd be slower than cold molasses going down a hill, but going up a hill actually. Which means that's that's damn slow. That ain't, you ain't even making it up that hill. <laughs> so, oh my God, you're so mean. No, I'm really not. I just I don't care. There's a difference between being mean and being mean and not caring. I just I, okay, okay. Oh, you're so smart. You just can't win with these people, bro. They always have something to say about how you are as a person. I'm good. You want to act nice? I'm just here. I don't have to act anyway. I'm just here. What do you want? What do you want from me? Here. There's the debit card now. I'm paying for my stuff. I'm out. I don't care. I don't care. So. These people just want <laughs> to get a real feel of you, bro. These people just want to connect with you so bad. Be nice to you so bad. Get your attention so bad. And people consider this stuff kind of mean, rude. Oh my God. Not me. I don't, because I'm not being mean. I'm not being rude. I don't act rude. I'm just quick. I, I want you to be quick too. Hey, I got shit to do. Ring me up. Some people get pissy, bro, because they want to talk to you longer. Some people get pissy because... They might find you attractive. They want to talk to you longer or something like this. It's like, I got to get going. <laughs> I got to get going. I got shit to do. I got babies' foreheads to kiss. I got shit to sign. <laughs> you know, there's, there's shit to do. So I don't spend my time overly investing in shit and... Investing in people, I don't even know who you are, but you're being crazy right now. That's what I'm saying, bro. People just have to feel some type of way around you, and I don't want to feel any way around you at all. I don't know you. You're a stranger. This is all business. 
I'm here right now because this is business. I'm buying shit I need and I'm out. I'm doing my business. I don't need to know who you are. I don't need to talk to you. So, that's why I'm saying it's just stupid. I, I, I don't understand how people even want to be that nice person. It's too much, bro. Like, what are you doing with your life? You're focused all your energy and time and being so damn nice. You forgot about your own life and your ambitions. And the way some guys, bro, talk to girls, it's just... They're trying to bribe these girls on these, like, with dates and, oh, I'll take you here and, and we'll buy all this stuff and I'll buy you this, the suppers and the drinks and I'll do this. And they're trying overly too much. If you were really a G, you would pull this chick, you wouldn't have to spend a cent. And you could, <laughs> you could have your way pretty damn fast. Just by being yourself just by being a good lad you're not being mean you're not being too nice either you're just you just you how are you good 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 so that's kind of what i'm saying bro be that person some guys feel the need they have to be that way and it's stupid it's just stupid. Just work hard, bro. Be yourself. Go through the world. Kind of cold a little bit. You got to be a little bit cold. People see it as cold. I don't even see it as cold. I don't really feel cold. I just feel like I'm outside of the matrix doing, going crazy, bro. I'm on a different speed of life. I've had people tell me before, I seen you at the grocery store and, and they text me up. Message me on Instagram or something. I've seen you in the grocery store. Oh, my God. I've never seen a person march through there so fast in my life. <laughs> you look like you're on a mission. I'm telling you, bro. That's my energy out there in the world, and, and it's true. Like, what they said was no lie. They were right. I walk in the damn grocery store, bro. I'm going through the thing. I already know what i got to do. I'm doing my round. I'm getting my stuff and I'm out. I'm not looking to be slow in there or look around and see if there's someone to talk to. I'm in and out. I'm just in and out. And you know why that is? Because I have a lot of shit to do as soon as I leave. When I get groceries, and that's just an example, I could be going anywhere. I could be going to the dentist, groceries, uh, a doctor for something. I could be going anywhere, or even an event. But when I leave, I have to, I, I got shit to do. I got emails to answer. I got shit to do. I got business to take care of. I got health and fitness regimens to make. There's always something. I got calls to take. There's always something, and that is what business is. That's the business world. That's what being ambitious is. But the people of the Matrix will view you as a bad person. Oh, he just thinks he's all this. <laughs> what does that have to do with anything? Have we even met? Have we even spoke? Have we even talked? You don't even know who I am. They judge you so fast. <laughs> and I'm telling you, bruh. Last thing is last. Stay away from the witches. The bitches. These girls are trying to be overly nice and you can be nice, just not overly nice. Stop trying to like, stop trying to be nice to get something or to make me do something the way you want me to do it. Stop. You can smile at me. We all like women that are happy and smile and all this kind of stuff, but. You're trying to project niceness onto me to make me do things a certain way, and you're trying to look into my eyes to try to take control over me like a witch. Bitch. Not happening. You can be genuinely happy around me without being that way. 
that's just I immediately look at you like you're something evil when 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 women do shit like that, bruh. I swear to God. Immediately I know something's up. You can be happy around me and stuff like that, just you're trying to project this energy onto me and you're you're up to you're you're up in my grill, you're up too tight, uh something's fishy. And sometimes the biggest sometimes like some of the women out there bro they be the worst behind the scenes but they be acting the nicest to you to make you think they're nice but they're not nice at all and when you kind of don't project niceness back you start to see who they really are and their real attitude it's like <laughs> I got it out of you there didn't I <laughs> I sure did stop playing stop playing me stop playing these games I know you're not that nice, lady. So that's kind of what we're talking about in this video. You know, don't be that nice, nice person. Be yourself. Walk through life the way you want to walk through life. It's genuinely authentic to however you are, whatever you're doing. You don't got to be on a crazy speed like me. You can be, but you don't have to be. But. I say do you, but there's no need to be Mr. or Mrs. Manipulative, nicey, nice person. I think it's it's lame, it's stupid. There's no need for it. You can be yourself. I like more straight up, harder, hard-nosed individuals. Where the connection is there and not even a word is spoke. Do you, ever, do, you ever, do you ever come across stuff like that, bro? You just acknowledge someone's presence. Me and a few guys that even go to the gym with, bro. Not with the gym with, but I go to the gym and see them there. Sometimes that even happens there. Like, you just walk in, you kind of nod at each other, and you acknowledge their presence, and there's, like, this energy where you see them, they see you, and it's just, it's a respect. That's good. We don't gotta be all up like this and wasting energy and... What is that? There's no time for that. And sometimes the people you kind of come in contact with and there's that respect energy. You can sit down after whatever you're doing, what you're doing, have a coffee or something, talk about some real shit. Drink some tea, drink some coffee, I don't know. That's the shit that I like, you know. Not people that's coming up to me acting a certain way and all this stuff. Get the hell away from me. Like, get the hell away from me. I don't have time for that. There's no time for that shit. Nobody wants to hear that shit. But anyways, I'm just trying to tell you guys how it is and do what you're going to do, I guess. But be that more, be more of like a good man, just a solid individual. That's got to go.